Yo, what's good everybody? It's your boy Shady and we are here for another first impression. And the box I have in front of me is a very special one. So if you are familiar with the FGC, you probably know what Moment 37 is. If you don't know what Moment 37 is, check this out. <laughs> Yes, the infamous Daigo versus Jay Wong when Daigo hit his Daigo parry. Now the story behind this shoe is there is a longtime trailblazer in the FGC space named Markman. Not only has he he's designed fight sticks, worked with Mad Cats and so many other companies. So Markman got pulled in by Nike and Markman wanted to make a shoe that paid homage to Moment 37. But there was some controversy that happened around this shoe. Basically, Markman was going through rounds of samplings and it was almost about to be completed. Then COVID hit, which shut down the world, as we all know. And Markman kind of, I guess, lost touch with the whole situation that was going on with these shoes. And one day he just goes online and see this shoe out in the world already, which is kind of crazy. A person that's helping design a shoe, imagine you help design a shoe and then you go on Twitter one day and you see the shoe you designed out without the company even telling you that it's out. Nike, I love you, but y'all gotta do better. That just doesn't make no sense. We're gonna get into the shoe right now. So looking at the box, Air Force One box, Nike, Air Force One on the top. On the side, it says final, final round, but it's white on white. So you probably can't see it out there. Maybe you can, I don't know. The text on the box is like doubled, kind of like a effect when you're going really fast and it's like a, let's get into the shoe. Oh, so right off the back, you know me, I love quality, I love packaging. And off the back, we get a dust bag. And on the dust bag, pretty famous quote, and it says, it's not over until it's over. It's really not over till it's over. Just the dust bag alone, it's a super strong canvas. This is not no cheap dust bag. It's real sturdy. We're gonna get into the shoes now. Oh yeah, yeah, these are fire. These are dope. These are dope. These are the Nike Air Force One Moment 37. So um, looking at the shoe, the shoe is basically covered in uh, all canvas. It's an all canvas shoe that's supposed to resemble Ken's Gi from Street Fighter. And if you look on the front on the lace lock, it's this like metallic blue lace lock that says Air Force One. And this is supposed to resemble your power up meter before you do a power move in Street Fighter. When you go to the back of the shoe, with this leather hit, it has the like double Nike air and it's supposed to resemble when you knock somebody out in Street Fighter, the way it comes up on the screen, which is super dope. As you can tell, Mark Man went in a, a lot of, he put a lot of detail and effort in this shoe, which I love. I think it's super dope. Got the Nike swoosh on the side, that's double layered, similar to how the Nike air is on the back. And on the lace, on one of the lace eyelets, there's like a, uh, it's like a spark like a spark uh, logo that's metallic blue. I'm not sure 100% what's that for, but I know it has something to do with in Street Fighter. Then my favorite part of the shoe, which I think is super dope, I, I think it's the, one of the dopest things I've ever seen on the shoe. On the inside of the tongue is basically the commands that Daigo had to pull off when he did the Daigo parry. It's, uh, I guess it was like seven, it was a seven hit combo that he had to parry, and then another seven hit combo that he had to parry, and then he pulled off a combo with the finisher we can, which became one of the biggest moments in FGC history. And I think that's super dope, and I think that's the best way you can pay homage to Moment 37 uh, on a shoe. I just can't stop looking at it. I think it's super dope. And just looking at this, like Daigo has to be a guy because I definitely couldn't, I wouldn't be able to pull that off. Look, look how long that is. Like I, no, I couldn't be able to do it. But um, overall, I think this is a dope shoe. I'm super sad the way that Nike did the release with number one, without telling Mark Man that the shoes was being released. And number two, they just 
put them out into outlets instead of giving these a real release as they should. This shoe should have got a real release. This shoe should have been covered by media and press and everything because moment 37 is a huge moment for all fighting game community fans. So Nike, I love you, but shame on you. Uh, Mark, man, these are super dope. You did a great job, man. And I'm happy to have these in my collection. Hope y'all enjoyed that first impression. My name is Shady and we're out. Peace.